Welcome to Game. Hey guys, and welcome to GT Live. GT Live. And the start of a brand new week. We were feeling fancy. It's Fancy Day Monday here on GT Live. Fancy Day Monday. Uh, the true story beside behind Fancy Day Monday. Is this us being fancy? This is us being fancy. In That's order it. to be fancy, one must do this with their hands. These are fancy hands. These are fancy hands. Fancy hands for a fancy Monday. Fancy hands, fancy hands. I feel like a cat. I Cat. I'm a kitty cat. And I dance, 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 and I dance, dance, dance. Cat. I'm a kitty cat. And I dance, 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 and I dance, dance, dance. Cat. Does anyone remember that YouTube video? Clearly I do. It was one of my favorites, and that cat looked just like a cat that I used to have. That was probably released before uh, Chris was born. Chris, do you know Cat? I'm a kitty cat, and I dance, 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 and I dance, dance, dance. I do know this. That was released along along with those other similar songy things. It was was in the realm of Keyboard Cat as well. This is Keyboard Cat, not to be confused with Fancy Hands. I'll play sexy things for myself when I'm dancing. Oh my god. <laughs> or no, it's I say sexy things to I myself. I say sexy yeah, things to it. myself. Well, I'm dancing. dancing. <laughs> that one is demonetized these days. I bet, because it says sexy. <laughs> and now we're demonetized because it says sexy. Uh, if you've never seen that old viral oh, video. It's just so worth it. It's classic. It's so worth it. That's like cat, what the internet just, was built just on. Just type in cat, I'm a kitty cat. And then, and it's just. <laughs> I'm a kid it's cat. it's, it's like <laughs> such quintessential <laughs> YouTube 2008. Oh, uh, it's so good. <laughs> you know, it's it's funny. I was talking with one of our editors uh, earlier today about how he he looks forward to the day when he can like talk to it. How people will talk about like, oh yeah, old Hollywood. You know, like the old directors from like the 60s and uh-huh. 70s are like, oh yeah, remember old Hollywood? And you like reminisce about it, like. We, we can talk about old YouTube. I mean, and I was telling. We're I was like talking those to him. curmudgeons. Well, I was talking to him. I'm like, honestly, you could. It's over ten years at this point. You could look back and be like old YouTube, like Cat. I'm a kitty cat and Chocolate Rain and all those old viral videos. So different. Like, it's so different nowadays. It's and so, so different. you'd be like back and back when I got started on you. You remember Cat? I'm a kitty cat. Oh, oh. And, and shoes. And shoes. Let's get some shoes. Let's get some shoes. Oh. Let's get them. Let's. Get the shoes em. cost. $300. Anyway, uh, so let's get them. Uh, right? It, it, but it is. It's one of those things so that you think good. back, like, oh, back in the old days of YouTube. So I was saying, like, yes, that'll only continue to get stronger as yeah. YouTube continues to grow and evolve. But this, like, creator era, we're already past the viral video era, and we're in that, like, creator area, which is starting to, like, drift into now reality the, like... Reality television. Kind of the reality television slash, like, corporate era, yeah. I guess. like. This is kind of where the creator era is coming to at least like a, a thinning down, mm-hmm. you know, That's which is, it is, it's an interesting time. Uh, but anyway, back well, to why we're fancy. We're fancy. We're fancy. Uh, we're fancy today. We're fancy today, and uh, it's a slightly shorter live stream today just because uh, we're headed to the It Chapter 2 world premiere. <gasps> I'm uh, so scared. Thanks to Warner way. Brothers. Uh, yeah, thank you, Warner Brothers, for sending us. Yeah, Warner Brothers is bringing us out to <sighs> the It premiere, which I'm, I'm actually, so excited about. I'm so scared. I, like... For horror movies, I'm one of those people who will like look stuff up ahead of time a bit so that I can go in kind of prepared. Because Matthew can tell you, I am, I really like genuinely cover my eyes during horror movies. I have a really hard time getting gory images, especially out of my head, and so I, I'll cover my eyes, I'll cover my ears. I get really scared. Yeah, I'm really scared for this. Which movie. is funny because you're the one who like got me to watch horror movies. I first, love I, horror movies, but I'm so scared. I'm a big scaredy cat, and Stephanie's like, I love horror movies. I'm like, okay. I'll watch I was it like, I was the one who intru- introduced Matthew to like The Exorcism of Emily Rose, and um, you just are the one who insists that we watch them. Which, I do. I'm like, I'm in the mood for a horror movie, and then I have my eyes like covered for. And I'm like, all right, I watch this, and I'll be like, and I'm I'm the one on the couch, be like, oh no, oh no, Matthew, no. Okay, you can open your eyes now. And I'll catch her up. I'm like, oh yeah, he just got like a bunch of nails shot into his head. Or ah! Yeah, Matthew will tell me when it's safe to look, and he'll narrate the whole thing with like, I, I think it's actually sometimes worse to have your narration than oh, to no. just watch it. Sometimes, myself. It, I mean, maybe sometimes it's worse. Sometimes and it's he's not. Like he's but, hacking through his arm with yeah. a bone saw. So, sometimes, oh, sometimes it's worse watching it. Yeah. Uh, anyway. So anyway, yeah, we're headed okay. to it, chapter two, which I'm super excited about because it one was actually one of my favorite horror movies from the last couple years. Yeah. Uh, I'm 
cautiously optimistic about it. If you guys know the original source material for the story of it, it gets weird. Yeah. Uh, Does before a the galactic end. turtle so, show up? Well, I guess we have to take bets. I mean, everyone. Five dollars. It's like it's like playing the like prediction bingo card. Mm -hmm. Like, will Maturin the cosmic turtle show up? <laughs> <laughs> Money's on no, but, right? But stranger Hope things have happened. Is also on no. But it's it's right. Oh, it's on no. <laughs> but it is one of those things that, like, uh, if you look at the end of it, there are some vague clues that could be pointing to if they choose to pick up the ball and run with the original ending of the story, they might be able to do it. So, like it's there. I see it there. As someone who knows where the story ends, I'm like, that's a very clear reference to where it's headed. But I don't think audience, mainstream audiences are going to want to see where this story ends up. So we'll see. Yeah. Um, I'm curious. I'm cautiously optimistic. Uh, obviously, we were already planning on doing a theory about it because it was just such a cool movie the first time. Uh, and I'm excited to see how it ends. But uh, anyway, so that's where we're headed to today. That's why we're a little bit fancier than normal because and we, we have, have to, to get head straight stream. out. Sorry, because we got to go, go, go. Yeah, so anyway, we're playing Horus. Uh, last week, I started playing this. Uh, the developer of the game actually reached out to me on Twitter and was very nice. Um, and it's, it's a super fun game. The mechanics are really cool because it's all about gravity shifting uh, with your kind of like gravity boots. So it's a fun platformer. The story is very deep, <laughs> uh, very interesting, a lot of characters. But basically, in case you missed what was going on last time, um, we are a robot who is finding our place in the world, basically. Uh, we, were, we were born and created, and we have uh, kind of made friends in this large, rich family. And then our creator all up and died on us, which sent us into kind of like a robot coma for a couple years. And then now we're awake and the world is now war-torn. And our job is to clean up the world and also just figure out our place in it. That's yeah. the long and short of it. All right. So it's He sort talks of like, a lot. He's a talkative robot. I Fair warning. Like this is like a Wally meets Edward Scissorhands. Actually, you know what? That is so unbelievably accurate for a hey game yo. that I just told you about like five minutes ago. <laughs> All right, let's play. <laughs> that's really fun. Wally, because he's cleaning up yeah. and he's a robot, and Edward Scissorhand, because yeah, that's that's exactly it. Hey, uh, engage with us. Hashtag GT Live on Twitter. Chris Use slightly it. updated oh, it. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, Chris. You okay. added like a little fedora feather. Is that what that is? Oh, it's it's fire. Like he's starting to malfunction, and he's frowning now. I. <laughs> Hey, I appreciate your eco consciousness and you know recycling your artwork. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hit us up in the chat where you're already saying stuff like someone remembered the ritual of chud from oh um, ritual of chewed chewed, yeah. chewed that's it from it uh, and stuff Got saying it. like <laughs> nope hopefully that doesn't make it nope. <laughs> it's gonna be a strange movie if that's in there. And Mary Elizabeth Nelson says, fourth live stream. Thanks for the wonderful moments on GT Live. All right. Oh, thank you. And Diddy Dupe says, Matt and Steph, fancy. Wow. All right, let's fancy Jen hands our way into this game. Channing Pepe Pappy says, now if only Steph could be always be fancy if it gets her mic'd up. Oh! oh! Burn. That was a sick burn. Accurate. Horace, play Cooper, game. Let's play. Uh, so. Here we go. We've collected 22,000 junk of the 1 million junk that we're supposed oh, to. Oh, thank goodness. We're on chapter four of question mark. And apparently, um, Chris said, I, right? That's the gravity shift Whoa. mechanic. Okay. It's very cool. Um, oh see, my gosh. Right? It's crazy. So we're just a little garbage man? Yeah, we're basically the universe's garbage man. Oh, Chris, you said that um, after we finished playing that something happened. Yes, yeah, so uh, unfortunately the game doesn't let you quit out during narration Whoa. periods, and this chapter begins with immediate narration. Okay. So, I'm so glad this isn't going to make me at all but dizzy. From behind it, Mr. Okay. Silton shouted, go back to the old man's house. Okay, gotta go back to the old man's house. So, okay. catch us up on what we missed at the end of the last live stream. Well, basically, that line kind of summed it up. Mr. Silton, you, you're you like, I want to see everyone in this rich family. And Mr. Silton says, well, it's not super safe for robots to travel right now. So why don't you go back to the house, clean up some trash there. He gives you a key card so you can get in from underneath, and then he's gonna meet up with you and help you find ways to travel around and see your missing family. Okay, and yeah. as I understand it, it's not, he's a little robot, and it's not safe for robots to travel because humans are afraid of them. Oh no! Yes, Shoot. robots, it seems like robots that aren't Horus are kind of evil. Oh no! You just killed him! I, I did, but you he has infinite You just killed life. poor Horus! 
It's not my fault. We had infinite gravity turned on. I you know, don't know, here's an interesting one, and I, I make this joke a lot on GT Live because I just watch way too many speedruns in my life at this point. Um, but I feel like this game would be fantastic for speedrunning. Like, mm. obviously, I haven't played the whole thing. Like, exploit all the gravity mechanics for yes. the shortcuts and stuff? Yes, there's so many, like, I mean, think about this. This is a game where I can basically jump infinitely yeah. as, as long as I'm successfully able to land on some sort of thing. That doesn't electrocute you. Right, or fall off the, boat the world. The okay. And so, it's one of those things that, like, th you could save so much time in this game. I bet speedrunners could find such, like, cool exploits. This would be fantastic to s Dear GDQ, Twitch speedrunners out there. Horus speedrun. Hor Horus, let me put it out there. Not many people have played this game. It's an open opportunity. This is a game that you should all play, friends. Let me throw it out there. Okay, so you I'm said- I'm not the seeing you collecting a lot of garbage. I've already cleaned up a lot of the garbage here. Okay. Last, ep last episode, I collected a lot of garbage. If you're sure. There was a lot of garbage last episode. Some of it was in the game. A lot of it was my commentary. <laughs> uh, so, Chris, you're saying in the basement as in go back to, like, the sewer system? No, like, go back across, like, get back on the boat and go back to the old house. Well, I or did. You, you're there. I'm there. So, yeah, apparently underneath, that's all I know, is he said beneath the house, there's some sort of I'm trying to think of how to get back. special access. Hmm. Okay, so, a, and forgive me for asking Chris about this stuff because I had to, like, I didn't see that cutscene, so he's the one who saw it before the game saved. So I'm just letting him fill me oh, in. Man, we're just relying on Chris's sto which is story. A, which is terrifying, oh, actually. Geez. Like, I think, I think we all understand the dangers that come with letting Chris. <laughs> you know, dictate what's going on in life. <laughs> okay, so... There we go. There. Right, but isn't this cool stuff? Oh my gosh, this is awesome. Like, the mechanic I'm, is awesome. Yeah, I mean, maybe don't play this if you have really severe vertigo. <laughs> but, like, this is awesome. <laughs> maybe don't play this if you have severe vertigo. You speed me right. You're like, I can see, this. like, oh man, I can see you, like, you know, you turn one too many corners and then you just accidentally fall off the couch because you're like, hello. The gravity mechanic. I, like I, that. Yeah. Anyway. Okay, so here was, here's part of the basement. Okay. Oh, but there was, um, now What are I, these little fellas? Those are not really Astronauts. made all that clear right now. They're, they seem to be versions of us. Oh. But they might be like failed versions of us. Not as well it's unclear. Right, not definitely not as dapper. Okay. Like they are not nearly as fancy as we are. Which, let's be honest, we, we are, are fancy. We are super fans. We are peak fanciness right now. <laughs> what are they about? What's that? Chris, are you just talking to yourself? Yeah, Alright, Chris. I was pointing out the, the naked robots. They're naked? Oh my gosh, Chris. What, what kind of game are you having us play? I'm this is, sorry. This is supposed to be the grand skinny safe. dippers? Supposed to be brand safe, Chris. Is this, is this where we're going in? This, you know, this is a great question, Steph. Let's try our key card. Oh, where? Yes. No, this isn't it. Oh, we've already been here. Okay. That's a level that we did last time. I know. I'm sorry you missed it. Oh, geez. Wow. The question is, where am I supposed to go? Here. I mean, I keep going deeper and deeper into this basement. That's the, okay, so this is a good thing. so okay. this is where I woke up. Oh, okay. Uh, we're gonna find here, it. Maybe the chat knows. No, the, oh God, the chat's on Chris's side. Undertale 954, Undertale says, tell Chris I like his hair. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> thanks. We are under the house. Hmm. Finding a way home. Mr. Sultan suggested I made my way back to the old man's house. I did, using okay. his security pass, I would be able to enter through the, ba through the basement. So there's a church that was locked outside, but that's not his house, it doesn't seem like. And then right, we're- Right, this seems awfully this, confusing. This is the basement. And there no. is a lot of basement here. There's a lot of basement, like it's a big basement-y house. And this was locked, but this is more sewer than it is basement, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is a pretty intense basement. Right? So. Whoa, jeez. Oh, oh man, that's okay, fine. okay. I don't, I don't think um, it's down in the sewer. I think it's 
I mean, this is basement. Right. Is the thing. Flea Goo says, after three years in archive land, I'm Australian. The time difference is horrible. Huh. I finally catch the stream. That's so awesome. Woo! Welcome. Welcome oh out of gosh. the archive, my friend. Right? Welcome, maybe, welcome. maybe under the church, says Neil Ham Ham, right? That's, I'm kind of inclined to agree. Yeah, that, like, I think it might be. Maybe we actually need to go next door. I agree. Because I, as I go through this, it seems oddly repetitive, which doesn't seem like it would be good from a game design decision. And also... Tony Starch says it's the area where the basketball court was. Does yeah, that yeah, mean yeah. anything to you? Yeah, that's the okay. church. That's okay. the church. <laughs> Or at least what I assume is the church. The chat always chat. knows. Right, chat knows. Except when they're trying to mislead us, and then they know, but they're not telling us. Right, then they're just being difficult. <laughs> oh. Then they're just being poopy. Okay. As I walked oh, the old there. church ruins, ah. I was surprised to hear Mr. Silton calling me. He said Mr. he had forgotten to give me something, and the church's community hall would be the perfect place to try it out. As soon as we Don't you dare take hall, me away from this Darren Mr. Church. Silton said he had a present for me. It was a pair of Atlas gloves. They made me think of the old blind man with the cat and his stolen Atlas gloves. What? I wonder if Mr. Silton knew I'll how to fill you in. Apparently there's a lot I missed. Up with a glove thief around. There's, there's a lot happening Mr. Silton in the story. Asked there's a glove thief? The gloves on and start chucking things around. I'm going to start chucking all over the place. He was very clear about that. <laughs> Mr. Cute. Silton suggested we clean the hall. Of course, I knew when he said we, he meant me. All you gotta do is but use your I shoe. Was happy right? To try out my new gloves. He's the robot. He said He's I got should a clear everything off of the basketball oh. court and put the things on the floor either side. I fiddled with the settings for a bit, but when Mr. Silton saw I was having trouble, he fished a small manual out of the box. He explained that pressing down and X would pick a thing up. Oh. X would then throw the thing, and if I wanted to place it on the floor, I should again press down and X. Yeah, this is super useful. Wow. Okay. Very thorough manual. I was gonna say this, this manual's great. Eventually, he finished by saying, "Well, I hope that made more sense to you than it did it to me." It did. So, okay, Phil, you knew in. Mr. Stilton was uh, the driver of the rich man. Okay. He's a former thief. Okay. So don't really trust him all that much. But he just gave us a present, so we like anyone who gives us presents, he right? Did just, he did just give us Strangers. a- Strangers. He did just give us a present. However, it's also one of those things where- Yes! Sweet! Um, it is one of those things- Oh, I was hoping you'd get an achievement or something. Right, I was kind of hoping that. Yes! No, no, no achievements, guys. Um, no, but it is one of those things where, one, we don't really trust him. Okay. Uh, and two, the, so the blind man that's being referenced here, right, is we helped a blind man who used to work for our, our dear old dead friend. Okay. Um, and now he had gloves that he was supposed to deliver to me and then got stolen. Ooh, okay. And so probably Stilton stole the gloves. Stole, okay. Basically the long story and is pretending to gift us with them. Okay, hold up. Okay, so we gotta clear out this ladder, man. Right. Go. What you doing? I'm trying to lift from the knees. I'm lifting. Lift. Not with your back. There you there go. There we go. Okay. There we go. So we just move it to either side. So it, yeah. So it's the difference of. Wow, piano. Impressive. Right. So the difference. No is, time for fun and games. I'm working on it. So the thing I wasn't getting was that you have to hold X as you press down, rather than pressing X while you're down. That's what I was. Unaware is by. Ooh, get out of here. Ooh, get out of here. Okay, let's get all this stuff. Oh man, that's a giant, that's a giant chair. Oh boy. Okay, here we go. Let's lift the nativity scenes because why not? Uh, okay. Uh. Throw little baby. Oh, baby. oh Joseph. Okay. Baby Jesus. Oh sweet baby Jesus. Oh Mary. Okay, there we go. Trophy. Dare. Don't you dare hit that spark. Oop. Okay, last Whoop, one. Okay. Come on. okay. Lift! Well, with the knees and not with the back. Go! Yes, Woo. memories unlocked! Let's see what else these gloves can do. That's all they can do. Mr. as he flicked through the manual. Yeah, Produce that's fireballs. Looked quite excited when he explained that holding X while walking into or under a falling thing would allow me to catch it. Ooh. Okay. I must admit, I was then really happy when he suggested we make it a game and I try to catch 10 basketballs. <laughs> <laughs> great. Ready. Wow, so this seems like a great use of everyone's time. I'm so glad that in the post-apocalyptic world, we're using robots 
to play games of catch. We have to we have to teach him his abilities, Stephanie. Look. Look at this. Boom! Look at me. I'm a ball catching champ. Good one. What I'm most impressed by is the fact that he got ten balls shoved into that small blue sack. Right? Honestly. That's pretty impressive. It looks like the controls on this are pretty tight. Oh, it's very much so. Yes! Controls are tight. Controls are tight. Mr. Silton suggested we make it a real game. Oh. See how quickly I could score ten baskets. Ooh. Oh. Oh man. Oops. I, I want to resume. I enjoyed this so much. It felt just like the good old days. Except, Except not because Mr. I was never Silk equipped with gloves back right? in the day, so. <laughs> okay, how quickly I can score 10 points. Ready, go. Whoops. Matthew. What? Oops. I'm a robot, not like a. Oops. There, boom. Oh, good one. Good one. one. Two. Get in there. Get in the hole! Ah. We need oof. Off the backboard. Man. What do you expect? Call me LeBron James! I expect nothing but net! Oh, come on. Not even basketball players can hit all their free throws. And they're, like, paid millions to do it. It always bothered me. It's like, this come on, Matthew's guys. This is Matthew's pet peeve with basketball, with, with in, basketball general. in general. He's like, if you're paid that much money and your entire life is devoted to practicing, and you're missing you should three. never miss a free throw. You should never miss a free throw! I don't know, I don't know how I feel about it, but Mr. Matthew Silken feels really adamantly about this. The high five. Oh, man. High five. Clap in half. He said I now knew everything about the gloves, and I should be able to continue through the basement of the church into the house. Great. Sweet! When if I only you had told me that was in the basement of the church. He just church. laughed and said they would right? catch up with me in the main hall. Great. Perfect. Um, right! Fantastic. Right! Come on! Come on, man. Seriously. So this is me collecting, so I, I clean up the garbage with my foot. Oh. Which is what's happening right there. Wow. I know, it's impressive. That your foot has some tremendous storage it, space. It's unbelievable how it functions. Really, it's it's second to none. Wow. See, look, wow. even my tie shows the gravity. It's, it's cute. I know, it's really cute. I like I like the effect of your tie. Like, the detail of the tie falling with gravity is, mm -hmm. I think, really smart. Um, it also helps keep you a little bit better oriented, you yeah. know? Yeah. But seriously, though, Free throws are so remarkably consistent. Oh my gosh. That why. You what about the intimidation factor? Maybe those mean, guys are nervous. Oh, poor babies. Go, I, go suck it up in your, you know, $25 million dollar mansion. For, I was going to say, for like the tens of millions of dollars a year that they get paid, like maybe they could get over the oh, nerves, maybe, but maybe, 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 Yeah, thank you. Maybe they have a little bit of stage fright. <laughs> poor, poor guys. Are you saying that you don't have pity for professional basketball players who are taller and more talented and make way more money than and everyone else in the world. And whose job literally consists of just playing a game? Well, you know the whole thing well, with job free throws, consists right? Of just playing. <laughs> what? I, don't, I don't know what you're talking about. They're oh. like, it is most basketball players don't free throw in an optimal way. I think there are two that throw underhand and no one else does because they're embarrassed of looking silly the for the quote cabin. granny throw. But like the when physics is down, just your odds I are going to be far to better and it's far easier to make a free throw if you things. throw it underhand with two hands. It's true. But you most know, people don't want to look silly. I've heard so this. Don't do it. I've read an article that this is true, that the granny so throw it is statistically group. better. It is. It's just like it makes everyone's like, well, I don't want to do it because I look dumb and people make fun of me. Right? It's like, yeah. hey, you were paid millions of dollars to win games for this team. Like, win games for that team. The, it? It's so weird, though, because you'd think that, like, I don't know. When you discover the best way to do something, you, you would just do, do it. it. Uh, like, uh, if it truly is better, I can't imagine. It's bad for the it's... brand stuff. But yeah, but if everyone started doing it, it would be completely normalized. And I mean, that's just the that's way that you would do free throws. Do it. That's the thing, though. Yeah, but if coaches started to mandate that that's how their players did free throws sure. for the good of the team, yep. and an entire team started, like if the Lakers started all doing granny shots for free throws because their coach mandated it, then they don't have to take responsibility for that it because it's not their fault. Their coach is making them do it. Yep. And if they start all of a sudden making all of their free throws, you bet all the other teams are going to do it too. Sure. Not to mention all the publicity you'd get for that first year. For, of right, right. To, be the, to be the oh, ones this, out there. Yeah, this team is doing this ridiculous thing or whatever. We but. know some basketball YouTubers. Now I want to ask them about the granny free throw. And, we, know and some, like, we know some basketball all-stars. That's true. 
Um, we could, I mean, we could, we could. <laughs> I wanna, I could. Now, now I really wanna know because <laughs> I, 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 this Carl just Anthony seems Towns. crazy. This the just seems like a exactly. crazy hey, conspiracy Carl. that they're not doing. Described it. I just hope that the card he had given me was the security key and not just some backstage pass. Well, it opened the door. But yeah, I feel like if, maybe off. if a team did it, they'd make it against the rules to throw it that way. Something <laughs> caught my but eye. But why? Just to make it here. harder. The book huh. next to it explained that it was a shield that Ooh, would I got a shield. Take Ooh. A hit from oh no, I can take hits now? Whoa, you're getting hit by stuff? Of storage, meaning I could save it for when the going got tough. Oh geez, I can oh, save it. Oh man, wow. man. Started with two slots to carry shields, wow, I'm, I'm accumulating all sorts of new stuff. To carry more. Whoa! If both Whoa. I and the shield died in the same room, okay. the Lazarus chip would bring us both back. It's almost as if the shield needed its sacrifice to mean something. <laughs> Whoa, it felt deep. like Whoa. a true friend, proving that even the simplest of faces can bring out an emotional reaction. Cool. Well, wow. I'm hiding your shield. Wow. Oh, oh my gosh. Whoops. I didn't. Oh, I should have kept my shield. Apparently, I didn't realize that I would hop onto the ceiling. I also thought that like the alarm going off would give me a sense of urgency. Nah, that's silly. I have a little, I have a little bit more time than I anticipated. Oh my goodness, this is serious. Flip, flip, Holy flip. Cow. Can I grab this? There we go. And throw it. Yes. Okay. Ooh, hello. Whoa. Oh, nice. Oh, you get another shield? What? I want more shields. Give me all those shields. All right. the shields. All the shields. All the shields. Oh, apparently oh, I've, I've, been, maxed I've maxed out my shields at two currently. Okay. Wow. Perfect. I'll get right. Look oh, at all man, this junk. I think we're like really OP now. We are. We're unstoppable stuff. This is it. Ooh, a 12 junk combo. You know it. Look at all that this. Sounds, oh, 40,000, buddy. That sounds like such an, ama an amazing achievement. I don't, I don't think you can get that amazing achievement. Oh. oh. I had to make a choice, Steph. There was a choice. That was Stop killing Wally. In the words of High School Musical, which is now becoming relevant again because of Disney+, Plus, there's a choice well, also, that you have to make, and it's very plain to see. You're either out or in. You either lose or win. Are you yeah. gonna... Wait, something about history? Are you gonna... Oh man, you can't even remember the lines, the old man. Jeez. Um, yeah, sorry, I can't remember the lines for a high school musical. Ooh, are these Yoku blocks? Like, are they fading in and out? Yeah, gonna say, yeah. Okay, so uh, we have to do something really quick. We're either out or in, you either lose or I can't tell if this is even a joke or not, but I'm going to take it very seriously in the chat. <laughs> That's probably the right answer. Hey guys, this is from Bookmouse. Hey guys. No! Oh no! Wait. What? Okay, what? What's up, Bookmouse? My guinea pig died today. Oh no. Yeah. And we used to watch the streams together. <laughs> Can you give a little mouse clap and a half in memoriam? I think, I think it's just a one finger. Ready? One, two, three. This is so sad. I see that. Really I, I, I totally believe that. How dare you doubt someone's in time cases, tragedy? No, that, I don't. I don't. I'm just saying. I, I actually love the idea of sitting on a couch with a guinea pig watching a YouTube live stream. I think that I think that's probably that's like living the life. I want to have that life. That, that is the life that you wish to leave. I jumped down there because I thought maybe there would be something. And Ryan Carson that. says it's okay, Matt. I hate Zach anyway. <laughs> Matthews, um, if you if you're like an OG viewer of Game Theory and Film Theory, especially, uh, you'll know about Matthews' ongoing feud with Zach Efron, of which Zach Efron is not aware <laughs> and has no understanding but, of Matthew's existence, but you Matthew say that. is very I don't know. sure he might have that been, they're he rivals. Might, he might have been shared on that film theory we did on Zac Efron. He might be quaking in his boots at this point. Matthew's really sure that they're rivals. Maybe he's jealous of the fact that we own a platform where we can speak directly to our audience, whereas he's just a hunky millionaire who could barely act back in the day and, luck and couldn't sing, but got blessed by the gods of Disney and is now made for life while we, you know, grind away. Yeah. Look at that. And who just cleared all the junk out of this room. Good job. Good Suck job, on that, Zach, Zach Efron. <laughs> Man, you're not clearing all the junk out of this room and helping this poor robot discover love for the first time. It's purpose in life, you know? Something Look, cool. let's learn about that robot story, shall we? But the old man had installed some software that helped show me things that were interactive. 
and how to interact with them. This must be what he was talking great. about. <laughs> great, I get to interact with something. The Boom! The electron gun blew the power. I needed to turn it back on before I could fire again. Turned off the power. The electron gun turned off the power, but apparently not enough to, like, stop the stupid alarm that's going off in this room. Or the- or the protective laser beam that's over here! It blew the power for everything else, but- But no, nothing that's relevant. Nothing. Okay, cool. That would've actually helped me in this circumstance. Fire again! Okay, that's all- that's all I can do with that very specific power gun. Uh-oh. And, <laughs> Melanicus says, I thought he was a pretty good actor. <laughs> Fine, he was so good. He was the best. Oh no, there's a, oh man, there's a boss battle. Whoa. Whoa, what? Whoa, hey, hey that yo. Is, this is unexpected. Okay, cool. Oh man. Oh, clean it. Hey, Chris, are we lagging? No, our TriCaster just stopped sending a signal, but we're back sending. Okay. Great. Cool. It was, it was, it was Zach back. Efron trying to take us down, wasn't Hold it? Hold on, get the app. Yeah. They missed the boss battle? There oh, was a missed boss- some of it. They missed them. Oh, oh, that's man. because it was so hot from the gameplay perspective. Okay, just try to just try refreshing if you can even see or hear us. It's Zach. It was either Zach Efron trying to silence us. It was definitely Zach Efron. Or definitely. just the the amount of crazy gameplay shooting directly into your eye holes. Right. Gameplay eye holes. The right. You can't. High you can't resolution. even. Gameplay ah! eye holes. Ah! 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 Like that. That's how much gameplay was shooting into their eye holes. Okay. Look. I'm just really glad about that. The video record. I'm so glad for my friend Zach. Like so there was a error. boss battle. It must we won. have been years since it. I had seen a film or TV show. Maybe I could take a little break from my quest and watch the film on the. We're tape. gonna watch a movie now. Oh my god. Look, As the, this is test number um, 107C. He continued as he read from a clipboard. This unit still has three major issues. That could be taken One, down so quickly by us! So oh! Think that the whole machine is still far too large and heavy. I'll see, there you go. Hmm. 72 yeah. ton. The missile system is too unpredictable and aggressive. There's a, and there's a three. Bit out the there. trade off between power and intelligence is far too great. Yeah, he was pretty stupid. I mm -hmm. think the military capabilities would be far too dangerous in the wrong hands. I think we would be best to push forward with the Innocence Project. Oh, I'm gonna be revealed as the Ooh. Innocence Project, aren't I? Yes. I, I have really a feeling I know where this is going. Yep. What he said. Horace didn't and know I what was happened. I'm slightly disappointed that he had recorded over the film, <laughs> but it was nice to see the old man's face again. Oh, see, he's happy. I wasn't so sure is he like a little butler on, robot but normally? Ooh, we're getting a present! Don't run away from the present! Oh, that kid present. I was gonna say, that okay. present's killing us. Oh, man. Don't you have a projectile now? No. Oh. Maybe not. I don't know what game you're watching. When did I get a projectile? I don't know. I, I got a I got a little shield head. face. Oh, there's some books there. I, I'm cleaning up junk, Steph. That's what we're doing. Right books now. are not junk! God! Look at this that. This video game is is trying to destroy literacy. I, wow. Wow. Oh my gosh, there's sentient everything. Wow. Oh no. Oh, get, sentient get head wrecked. shears are the worst. Get wrecked, shears. Boom. Roasted. Boom. Get dunked on, moose head. Yes. That moose head didn't know what hit it. Right. Mostly because it's not a thinking creature. Oh, is that a turkey? No, it's just a random sack. No, it's sack. just garbage. Just I was garbage. hoping for a turkey. Oh, yeah, here we go. Yes! That's what I meant by Yes, two style. combo! Oh, yeah. Shoot, there's sparks I there. That. I, can't, I can't, they can't pick it up. Yes, I got one. I think I have to abandon it. Can you crouch? Else. Can't do not, like a robot slither? Yeah, I don't think I can do that. No. I don't think I can pull that one off. Right. Unfortunately. Can you knock it out? Can you pick something else up and no, hit it? No, we'll, we'll have to return at a later date, oh, I have a feeling. Oh, get ready. Look at all this. Oh, so much junk combo! C -c -c combo breaker! Super junk. Super junk combo! Oh, man. This is like... Oh, no! This is kind of satisfying, cleaning up trash. Oh, you junked it. Oh, man. Right? That's, that's kind of what I was saying on the last live stream. 
where like one of the things I loved about Super Mario Sunshine is the fact that like you could just clean all that stuff and it was really satisfying. Matthew is really into cleaning. Um, love cleaning. I, I actually enjoy cleaning too. It's like I actually think it's like Whoops. sort of nice. I realized I wasn't able to walk on that. Um. Well, it's one of those things, Steph, where, oh, well, you should tell everyone how impressed you were with how clean the house was when oh you got gosh, back Oh my gosh, it your, was so clean. So I was away trip. this weekend and Matthew cleaned like a whole bunch of stuff in the house and it looked so nice and it smelled so nice. It didn't smell like our cat litter boxes anymore. So that was really exciting. That was great, actually. You did an awesome job. Um, but lots of people, not just like YouTubers and stuff, but definitely YouTubers, um, but lots of people in Los Angeles in general, I think Ooh. hire... Whoa. Whoa. What? Wait, what was Whoa. that? What was that? Whoa. What was that? Um, that was a new mechanic. Hire people to come over and help like clean a part of their house every once in a while. And we don't actually because we both enjoy cleaning. Yeah, we do. We like it. And we're like, oh, I think we'll do a better job anyway. That is accurate. <laughs> Someone gifted us one time uh, like a cleaning service. And you know, it was very nice. It was very it nice. It was really sweet. Right, it was right after the baby was born and my mom was like, hey, you should worry about the baby. And you know, I, she lives across the country so she couldn't come over and help us clean anything. And so she was like, I will, I want to send you guys someone to clean your house like once a month for the first few months that the baby was born. It was super, super nice. It was. And it was awesome. Like it was awesome to have that done, especially when we couldn't do it. But we actually kind of liked doing it. Also, they weren't the most uh, like effective cleaners. I thought they did a very good job. Yeah, all right. <laughs> yeah, all right. I mean, you know. You know I mean, I, I, know, I know your stuff is real grimy. Whoa! Or, you know, Whoa! There's lots of. Hey, wait, wait, what? <laughs> who's who's gr what? Who's grimy? Get out of here! We're the only ones. We're the only ones. What? Who are grimy? You know who like cleaning? I'm, I'm offended by you saying that I'm grimy. I am hurt, Steph. Words hurt. Matthew literally texted. I'm getting on a on the plane to come back to LA last night, and Matthew texts me. He's like, "Man, I've got to get in the shower." I stank with an A. I, I, he was I like, mean, with an A, I stank. That, hey, <laughs> that's what happens when you're cleaning up and also when you are building toys for your innocent bab. <laughs> that's true. Matthew built Oliver one of his, a, a toy that he was gifted for his birthday, but that we, he's been playing with in pieces. And so Matthew Jeez. was like super dad and like built it. And it, was, and it was a lot of physical effort in the hot sun yeah. of California. Me being pro dad, <laughs> pro dadding it up. So, and I was sweaty because as a man, you work up a sweat when you're working with construction tools, it's you true. know? It's true. Abigail Chapman says, uh, thanks for distracting me from my first day of school homework. It is the first day of school for a lot of people today. Oh my like gosh. All across the country and stuff. Some schools have already started. So, you know, no need to educate us on your, on your, school schedule if you've already started, but congratulations for those who it's your first day and if you're already in the thick of things, good job so far. Woo! Hang in there. Labor Day is almost here. <laughs> <laughs> you're almost You're, almost, you're almost to your first day off. Right. Waste no time there. Right. Okay, here we go. Oh man, we've got all sorts of weird sentient creatures. We're, we're exposing everything. Right? There's all sorts of secret things that my old master was working on. Oops. Oh, Man. Do you miss school stuff? I miss some things about school. Yeah, what do you miss? But I don't miss school. I actually, my, my number one stress dream, I have a recurring stress dream and someone else, I think it was Jason or Chris, has the same recurring stress dream that I have, which is about, or a similar one, which is about like in my dream, I'm about in, birds. I'm in. No, are you, that's are you being Jason. Are you being attacked by birds? Because <laughs> if if so, then you and Jason should talk. I know. No, uh, birds are always nice in my dreams, but uh, I do have. I'm <laughs> lucky. I have this one where I'm in college and I realize that I'm in a class and it's the end of a semester, but I've never been to the class before, and either it's like an attendance-based class, so I know I'm already failing, Ooh. or. I know nothing about the class, but it's like the day before the final exam. Ooh. And so I have like no hope of catching up. That's my number one stress dream. And I don't know why I still have it. I, I couldn't tell you. So like that I don't miss about school. Oh, 
I went to all my classes, but like the idea of like being stressed out about exams or whatever, I don't miss that. But I no. like I think the thing that people know about us and this like the channels that we run is that one of the reasons we run them is because we love learning and school is one of those things that gives you an excuse to learn full time. Yeah. And that's pretty cool, you know? So I miss that. And also being able to sign up for like Sign up for classes and feel that like excitement of the beginning of the semester. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, I get that. Where you're like, oh my gosh, this semester is full of so many possibilities and it's awesome. Um, and I also liked how it chopped up the year nicely. And you always had something to look forward to. Whereas when you get to be an adult, it's like this year is just going on and on and on. And, and sometimes time one. goes really fast and sometimes it drags really slow. But you have to like make your own milestones when you're an adult and when you're in school they're just built in for you that's true it's also i mean it's even harder in in california honestly because california there's no weather to demarcate time either which is even more makes it even more confusing because mm -hmm. in ohio at least you have seasons and so you're like oh yeah it was cold when this thing happened or like yeah it was remember. fall whereas in california it's like well it was 70 and sunny. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's still 70 and sunny and oh, it's Christmas. It's still 70 and sunny. Right, yeah. All no, right. I'm not really seeing a whole lot of Christmas and lights. And hey, no one should complain about that, but it's one of those things where time just kind of goes by and you don't really notice that it's going by because nothing around you ever really changes. It's weird. But everything it's weird. Cha nothing changes. And everything and changes. Everything changes. Do you miss school? Um Do I miss I, you know I liked school a lot, um, but I also, I don't know, do I miss school? Not, not really. I think, I think homework was pretty excessive in a lot of cases, like, I think homework in a lot of cases is, is pretty, you know, unnecessary or redundant. Um, I like the feeling of having it completed, but I, I didn't really like doing it. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, I, I will say that, exactly to your point, it's nice to have projects that complete. Yeah. Like, our life now is just, like, out in the working world. Batches yeah. Coming you just all the shapes and sizes. work. Oh, oh, Whoa. Oh, hello. What hello. Is what is this? Oh, boy. This is a battery, I guess? Okay. Um, you know, and so that's, that's one of those things that I miss, is definitely the idea of... Yeah, nothing's ever really finished. Like, we finish episodes, and that's good, but, like... The channel is this like always ongoing project. Like you never finish the YouTube channel, and so stuff just kind of goes on and on. Um, or there's more pro like, and you tend to get more projects rather than less projects. Right. And so like, this is also let me just call this out because this is a really cool mechanic, right? Mm -hmm. So I have this heavy thing. Yeah. Which makes so gravity's pulling it down. Oh, so you can jump. So my higher? jump is higher. No way. That's really smart. Like. This That's game, awesome. and, and I'm also fighting gravity here mm -hmm. because it's trying to pull me down as I'm, this is great. That like, is so cool. The attention to detail of the physics of this is really impressive. That's awesome, It's man. really, really cool. I gotta say. I'm really impressed with that. Like that's such a cool attention to detail moment. Right, that's really neat. That's really smart and it, it's a very advanced way of like using these sorts of mechanics. Mm -hmm. It's very, very cool, okay. So yeah, on that perspective, I miss it, but I, I don't know, like, no. <laughs> right? I think also- Cause I, cause I, you know, what I liked, like you just said, having the excuse to learn was what I liked most about school. Yeah. But we kind of, oh shoot, but we ah! kind of created that ability through these channels, right? Yeah. Where, where like, yeah. our, our show, right, is all about learning and gives us an excuse to research stupid topics every week. Yeah. That was intentional, right? Like, one of the reasons why... Oh, shoot. My bad. One of the reasons why, back when I was, like, looking for a job and creating game theory was because I wanted something that kind of, like, sparked my curiosity and got me to learn new things. Yeah. And so, so yeah. I can, uh totally see. And on the homework thing, I think it might have been different for you and me because 
I think one of the places where homework is the most overbearing is middle school. Yeah. And because I was homeschooled in middle school, mm. I didn't have homework during that time. I just had a whole bunch of extracurricular activities. That might be. So like I, in my experience of middle school was doing school until like 1 p.m. Yeah. But then having like piano lessons and dance lessons and uh, Girl Scouts See, and whatever other stuff, and swimming. I did a ton, ton of swimming that all makes the sense, time. Man. And so most of what I also TV. remember from Mama's being in school is being in a lot of extracurricular activities. Yeah. I do, Jeff like in high school, I had a lot of sport. Yeah. <laughs> that was very odd. That was weird. Of the old man. Hello. Uh oh, here Hello. we go. Came his voice. More again. lore. Right. Horace Lore. Loris. Lore. Program immediately. <laughs> All production to be stopped. Contain the remaining units in these corrosion-proof canisters. Uh oh. Nanobots. Uh oh. The nanobots are free. Although I'm sure and they are corrosive. Oh boy. The old man continued. Or they're corroded. We have discovered that they are essentially unstoppable and can oh, form a controlling intelligence around any object. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's why everything was attacking me. I get it. That's why you had all the magical objects attacking me. Need Man, say Brave more. Little Toaster is the best. Well, that just reminded me of that Brave Little Toaster. Why everything moved with minds of their own. Yep, see, I'd never Horace been in and this I part of the before, but I figured I would get back to more familiar surroundings once I made it through these laboratories. This whole, this house is amazing. It is. This is like, like pretty incredible. It's enormous. Right? This Loris. This is amazing. Yeah. Two floaty heads. All about them floaty heads. Right, but you would have people being at like, again, going back to the speedrun stuff. Mm -hmm. You could, you would have people like de-boosting through everything, mm -hmm. just to save a couple seconds here right? and there. Of oh, I, I took a de-boost here. <laughs> here. Here's me taking a de-boost. I'm de-boosting so that way I can make this cycle of right. the platform. The use of the shields becomes super important. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so oh, satisfying. Oh, this is great. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that combo. Catharsis. And now combo. when you switch direction, oh. Oh, and then you have different run categories. Yeah. Like, oh, I'm the million junk versus like Ooh, I'm the just the speed run. I'm the speed, I'm the general. Like, oh yeah, oh, oh eat it up, eat yes. it up. Yes. Gotta go back. Oh, go it's back. my three junk combo. Oh, yes. yes. Oh, no. no. Oh, see, I, I tried to take a D boost there, but it didn't work. So you know, this is a finicky section of the level. Is it? You know, the D boost is very inconsistent. <laughs> Yes, eat it. Wait, eat it. You want eat it. Eat it up. Eat it up. Eat it up. Eat it. Eat it up. Eat it. Eat it. Okay. No. Keep eating it up. Come on. Eat Come that on. witch's hat. There it is. Okay, eat my fine. robot brethren. Eat Damn. them. Yes. Shove them in your toe and process them or whatever the game's <laughs> having you do. The very effective trash compactor is all that's it's, really down it's there. It's unbelievably effective. Okay, here we go. Wouldn't that be funny if slowly over time he gets taller and taller because as, <laughs> as more and more junk gets accumulated in my toe. <laughs> Great. Uh, yes. Oh, so good. Great. This is like an obsessive compulsive's favorite game. Hundred percent. Oh man. It's all right. It's okay. I keep thinking there's got to be an achievement for some of that. Uh oh, here we go. What's okay. happening? Are we gonna have another boss? Nanobots activated. Oh, they're gonna be a snake. Woo, snakes. Oh, this Aww. is an experimental security system. Here we go. Right, Destroy the humanoid. The this is it. Okay. Go time. Woo! Getting serious now. Right row. Woo snakes! This is boss number two. Maybe that other one was a mini boss. Oh no, it's gonna challenge my basketball skills. Well, get ready. I'm gonna do just as well as a professional basketball player because, you know, they don't always hit free throws. And they're paid millions to do it, so, uh, you know. What am I supposed to do here? How do I beat, how do I attack this thing? Let's play, figure out how to attack this. Oh wait, I see it. There's a device upon which I can climb. Grab, grab, grab the device. Where do you, where Whoa. Do you Oh, that thing Whoa. Right there. Hey, hey. Oh, hey, oh, watch out. Oh man, you already sacrificed a, oh, poor Smiley. There, okay, there we go. So you gotta pull him in, oh jeez. What do you do? I gotta oh, pull him pull in him half. Up. Whoa, I have what? no idea why that just happened, but cool. We'll just say yes. What? We'll just go with that one. What are you hitting him with? 
playing him oh. with the power of grabbing. Okay, hi. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. This oh game has goodness. suddenly taken a very stark turn from I what know. it was. Okay, hey. Hello! Oh, oh no! no you toasted! You toast! <laughs> Boom! Roasted! Right. Boom, oh. roasted. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, no, 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 no. Nope. Okay, so. Pull. I can't. There's fire right there, so I need to actually, like. So. Okay, here. Oh, yeah. pull, 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 pull. Go, 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 go. Nope. Nope, I'm missing the pull. Shoot. Oh, oh, no! Oh, God. Oh, oh, this is brutal. This is tough, man. This game has gone from just like simple platform so to, like, this, to like to like hello difficult. Right? This is a, ooh, 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 ooh. Go, pull, pull, pull. Go, yeah, okay. So I only have to do one then. Oh, jeez. Nope. Boom roasted. Boom roasted. Okay, there we go. Good. Okay, so we're here. Okay, duck, duck, move, duck. Oh my oh goodness. My oh my goodness. Wow, this is wild. This is really hard. Okay. I'm this is great. I'm so impressed by this. I did not anticipate. There we go. Not anticipate this being the case. Wow. Are we know? hitting him? Yes. At all? Uh, yes. We're, they're, we're, we're, oh god. Are you sure? He doesn't seem to be saying like owie or anything. Fine. He's a he's a cre he's a snake creature made of boxes and basketballs. He's not going to be saying owie a bunch. Okay. I think we did it. Oh no, never mind. No, definitely not. Boom roasted. <laughs> Boom roasted. <laughs> Boom roasted. Okay, here we go. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay, he's going to fire out stuff. Yeah. Whoa. Oh hey. Whoa. Okay. Oh my gosh. So it's combination like bullet hell, gravity mechanics, and platformer. This is wild. This is amazing. This actually. is really impressive. Oh Oof. shoot. I could not jump that over that. That was not worth it. Pro tip: Do not try to jump over that. Give it to Go. Yes. He Whoa! Oh, oh, hero oh, land. Yeah. That's legit. I love how he straightens his tie. Right. Let like, me <laughs> just my tie. That was awesome. That was so cool. This is such a wild game. Right? This game. Constantly Unexpectedly a really cool. <laughs> it's just constantly surprising me. It's like, oh yeah, it's a platformer with cool mechanics. Oh, and also this like random, really intense boss battle mix. Right? In. Okay. It's very odd. Uh, at GT Convoy says, this oh, game low-key has old school Paper Mario vibes, and this is a total Bowser-inspired boss fight. Right? Oh, that's it's, interesting. it's super fun. Yeah. Oh, watch out. Okay. What? At the GT okay. Life Gobi says, no one. Blank. Literally no one. Yeah. Matthew, being salty about professional basketball players. Hashtag GG Live. But seriously. But seriously. Um, do, at insert text dance. here, it says the music is so good. So these are, I'm assuming, yeah, they're this cycle. Like at Blue Twilight Lee 1 says, lol, the toaster was a Ghostbusters reference. How did you not notice that? You know what? I've, like, I've only seen that movie once. I I, You've seen Ghostbusters. No, I, no, I, no, I know I've seen it, but I... Trying to think of how often I like. It was. I I actually like the second one better than the first, which I think was like last week. At do not says, one. was that a Ghostbusters two reference? Apparently so. Uh, God, it's been so long. Don't don't judge me for how long it's been since I've seen <laughs> Ghostbusters. Last time I watched it was for the episode on film theory that we did on Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. <laughs> At Optip Optipestit. Optipessimisty says, I get stress dreams of either being back in marching band, concert band, and being yelled at by my instructor for not knowing the music, or I have an exam or paper due for a class. I graduated university last year. <laughs> yeah, those dreams just continue forever, apparently. Congratulations, welcome to the next decade. Welcome to adulting. <laughs> Ooh, hey. Um, wow, that was a really tricky section there. I'm glad that I did that. Oh yes, more free trash. Yes, give me all your. T this also, uh, sorry, uh, going back to the game real quick. Just calling out the fact that this game has gone from like zero to a hundred in a hurry. Like, we went from hey, there's a couple of mechanics and it's and it's super fun, pretty pretty simple, but like really awesome gameplay. To now it's like oh, there's like legitimately challenging platforming going on. Right, this, they've upped the difficulty. Yeah, pretty this is amped up. In a hurry. Yeah. Ever since we shot, ever since we defeated like Cannon Guy, it's mm -hmm. been like much more He was more like the warm-up boss, and they're like, "Okay, you're ready for the big time." Right now, it's like, "Hey, here's all of the mechanics." Right. Again, this, which just makes it better, even for speed running, I think. Oh shoot! Oh. Whew. One. Shredded. Right, and it's also Ooh, one of those shredded. things because you also have got to think about it from a like a gravity standpoint. From the gravity standpoint, because mm -hmm. that's another way of dealing with problems. 
here is probably better to deal with this from this direction. Ooh, 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 Maybe. Ooh, ooh. Oh no! no! Wow, this is rough. Okay. Yikes. This is nuts. Um, see, this is all cycle based, depending on the saw blades as they go around the platform. So we want to make sure we hit it on the optimal cycle. I'm gonna deboost. Oh, okay. I'm gonna deboost through it. Real okay, quick great. Here. Yeah. I'll read Twitter. At HeartFanArt says, I just received my first piece of Game Theory merch today, the pencil case, just in time for school to start. Yes, that's Yay. awesome. Thank you for being with me while I struggle through school and for continuing to be with me through my first job. You'll probably never see this, but thank you. Oh my oh. gosh, we saw it, and oh, thank, you. It. thank you. That's awesome. No, of course. And it's also one of those, like, it's interesting, right? Uh, At, ooh, this is really cool. At BrookeB1271 says, I started 10th grade in online school today and my electives are med medical terminology, criminal justice, and French too. How cool is that? That's one of those things That's where wild. like, with the internet opening up so many more possibilities for education, I just think school is bound to become, like has the potential to become so much cooler if it's not, you know, like if it's not just, I don't know, if schools will like lean into it and take advantage of it, it could be so cool. So you got this. I triggered the security camera. Mm -hmm. That's water. Oh, that's, that's, that's me dying. That's me very effectively dying. Huh, weird. Am I supposed to do something? It's, unless I just missed that one puzzle or something. No! Come on! No, no secret unlocks. Come on! No! Okay, fine. Be that way. There's water there. Stop it. Stop running into it, Matt. No, you must. So I beat the boss. It must have to do with this room. I can't unlock this thing. I can't pick it up. Hmm. Can I just throw this? I hear it's about this, so I'll make it easier. Yes! Oh, that's oh, great. That's a okay. lot easier. That makes it a lot easier. Great. Okay, no. So. Hmm. Huh. What am I supposed to do? I guess it must be in that upper room. Right? It's very weird. That makes this one. <laughs> um. Got this. Fire. Okay, I'm gonna read a few more things from Twitter. Um, let's see. Okay, we'll move forward. No, hey, please leave those glowy things are bad. I'm gonna door about the cycles here. Go right past it. Wait, you're on Twitter? Yeah, I'm on Twitter, man. Are you kidding me? <sighs> Who are you? I don't even know you anymore. Uh, oh, at Hello Person 9101 says, making dinner and these sentient knives are freaking me out. <laughs> right? Right? I'm seeing a lot of people who really like school, but not necessarily the classes or like the way that school is done. Like Grace Hutton says, I like learning, but I don't like school. And J at J Coffee no, 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 no. says, school is nice, I miss my friends a lot. <laughs> Um, and then at Sexual Topiary says a lot of people miss the structure of school rather than school itself. I think that's something to, that's something I miss. Right? Right, structure. Yeah, I think structure is one of those things where it's there's comfort in structure for as obnoxious as it is a lot of times. You don't have to make as many decisions. Right. It is nice to like that is one of the hardest things about being of, of adulting or being an yeah. adult is having to just constantly make decisions. Make decisions. And you don't so have to like second guess how you're spending your time because you're like, okay, wall. I have to be I'd doing to this. Keep jumping to climb it. Oh yeah. Look oh out. yeah. Oh, man, Whoa. What's on that side? Is that all dangerous <laughs> Right? It's what metal. is that? Electrified boots? Wow, and now we're Pull in on wall jumping as a new mechanic. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Hey. 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 Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. 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 Watch oh out there. Okay. Watch out wow, there. This is this is a tough wall jump. Woo. Okay. For the first time, you're wall jumping in this game. That's intense. It's hard. Oh, that was, oh, oh that. Oh, you are nope, just gonna. So you're you're I'm burning. Dead. You're burning. Yeah, just, okay. Yeah, okay. Great. We're just we're just I'm frying. Watch me fry. Nope. Great. Hmm. <laughs> Curse you, evil sentient boots. Right. 
we go. So now, this way. Careful. At Joshi Shadow says, normally I would take so much more time, but given the fact that Matt and Steph go earlier, I decided to speed draw this. I'm already in coloring, but I had to share this ridiculous sketch. Oh, he's drawing us on the stream today. Oh, that's oh, great. Oh, that's so awesome. It is so cool how people do that. I love it. It is amazing. People are really talented artists. Right, I know. I wish I had talents. Here we go. <gasps> Woo! Oh. No, no. Oh. Chuckled Mr. Silton. It's all right. We'll claim it on the insurance as accidental damage. That is. Get what? me a new TV. No, they're, they're not going to cover that. that. Nah. They're not going to cover they're it. They're going to deny that They'll claim. Never cover I explained again. to them that I had found some of the old man's home videos, and the contents had shocked me. The dirty <laughs> old bugger interrupted Mr. Silton. But I didn't know what he meant. So I continued explaining he about thought the it was nanobots explicit and videos of the old man. Ah. See, I thought they were the potentially case, brand unsafe in nature. Oh my. Mr. Preston, Fit for other streaming platforms. But not this one. No. I wasn't sure what Mr. Silton meant by rescue, but I thought I would leave them to clear up. Right, do some work around here. I'm having to hop around. As we made our way back outside. Uh oh, cold and ominous. Uh -oh. Meet the others. I need you to help me get my stolen van back. It's probably in my shoe somewhere. Right? Let me just it's pull some gears out of my shoe. And you can build a van with that. Expend, uh, dependable. The equipment was heavy, but I was happy to help pack the large boxes until a Preston returned with what Mr. Silton called the mean machine. Oh my. Oh, here we go. Oh, baddie! This is one bad A van. Here it is. Mmm, look at this. Rockin' my milk van. Uh, they see me rollin'. They hatin' my milk van. Ooh, Mr. Silton's van. Are we all, are all we are is dust and shadow. Ooh, okay, let's get this Mr. one started Preston and then we're gonna have to go. more okay. anxious than usual. Then he had to pee. At first I thought he just oh. needed to see, use Oh, horse and I, same wavelength. Right. We're practically the same person. Emotionless robots. Lived around here. Somehow the money went missing when we robbed that post office. He continued. For some reason they thought we'd taken it, but, as he put it, why would we live in such a dumb if we had a load of money? It's a fair point. Yeah, fair. Although this clarified things for me. It certainly didn't calm Mr. Preston, who ah. suggested we got to move on. Don't We've got worry. ominous music You'll playing in the background. Minutes. We just need to send Mr. Chips up there to have a look, said Mr. Silton as he pointed to a window high up the building. Oh yeah, we're go breaking on. and entering here. He said with a smile, off you go then. Uh -oh. Here we go. Rat row. Speed run. Here but I come, not GDQ. Too fast. Not, not faster than you can pick up the bags. Yeah, we gotta pick up the bags. Man. The way that they've decided to protect this apartment building. Very strange. A very strange arrangement it's of like they electrified just barbed ran wire. Ran out of electrified barbed wire right there. It's that like one spot. Right? They're like, you know what? That's enough electrified barbed wire. Let's put it in this odd vertical arrangement now instead. Yeah. That, that'll, that, that'll, that, that'll that, help. That's appropriate. That's that's gonna keep out everyone. Except for, Ooh, you know, the Play-Doh shrimp. Oh, two ninety five for a wow. plate of shrimp. That's what a is, steal. Man, that almost makes it worth the world's apocalypse. <laughs> The man didn't look like a thief. Oh, that's what maybe he's he's got a gun. Jump, it was in the wash. Mr. Silton was certain he'd stolen Aww. the van. Bell. Oh no, we're gonna. So I watched for a moment, but then I heard Mr. Silton. Don't trust him. Up. He's no, evil. Don't do it. I've been calling it since I day was one. I going to speak, but Mr. Silton held a finger up to his lips. He if he was gonna come up here, why did he send us for up? A moment. Apparently, he's very <gasps> effective at. Once oh, I got a crowbar. Oh, no. We were inside. Oh, Mr. Crazy. Silton whispered that I was to go one way while he went another. I'll go on Why the ceiling because I'm able to do that. Where are we going? Uh-oh. Find the keys to my van Robocop, said Mr. Silton <laughs> through gritted Aww, teeth. It's funny because he's doing an impression through... <laughs> he's reciting what was said. So it's it's like three layers of robot voice there. <laughs> kind of... Oh, okay, this is going to be... Yeah. Wow. Oh, right? yeah, I'm I was concerned. gonna say that's that's a tough I'm little concerned. that's a tough little transition to make. There we go. See now, if you catch it at the beginning. See again, this is very Ooh, cycle dependent, Stephanie. Weird. So if you're able to catch it at the early cycle, you're able to get up here and collect that garbage. Holy cow. See. Again, this is why I'm qualified to be a, a GDQ speedrunner. Because I can say the words. You're not. D boost. <laughs> D boost. Cycle. Speed run. Speed run. This is me. 
This is, uh, this is my PB. This is your PB. This is my PB in Horus. your P only. Doesn't change the fact that's my PB. It's your PF. Get a PB. Your P first. Oh, that's a trap. Is it, or is it junk for me to collect? Right? I don't know. No, but it's a trap. It's a trap. Definitely that skewered you like a shish kebab. Okay. I just wanted to show off that mechanic for the audience, uh -huh. as well as that mechanic. Sure. Really wanted to, okay, okay, I thought that one was actually cleared, so that's totally my fault. <laughs> That was, that was, that you was. You wanted to just make sure we really knew it. That was a pee mistake. <laughs> per, <laughs> personal mistake. That's a, that's a new one in the speed running oh language. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, that, wow, that is a really challenging jump for me. Okay. Well, honestly, Matthew. It's a very, it's a very, what? It's a very, honestly, I, yes, it's a very challenging jump to make here. Okay, here we go. Okay, there we go. Got there it. you go. See, no sweaty. I don't even know where you're walking. All right. I'm walking in Memphis. Walking with my feet ten feet off of Beal. This is a very redundant line in the song. Let's be honest. There you go. Get that garbage. Yes, all junk collected. Good one. You know it. Oh, I'll collect that telephone. Oh, those are those are spikes. Ooh, Wait, whoa, man, this whoa. guy's apartment built. Like that auto flares. That friendly old man has the best apartment building complex. He has some serious security measures in place. Oh, we're gonna put a car in our shoe. Yes, get in my shoe car. Yes. Yes! Oh, that was great. Bam! Oh, look at all this. I even got so a floating head. So much garbage! Head. No, let, let go. There we go. Okay, here we go. Yeah, yo! Flip and flip and over and run! And, run. and jump! And jump! And run! Oh, yeah. Oh, get, get on it! All junk collected! Hey, yo. Yeah, yeah! You got none, son! I felt at home here. Get all the huge piles of junk everywhere. I feel like the piles hey. of junk are literally just yeah. in this post. Like, man, they even have compactors in this apartment. Right? Woo. This is actually part of where your HOA fees go huh. at this apartment complex. They're like, you know what? We've got a laundry. The hydraulic press. But what we've really got is a hydraulic press. We've got like eight of them, actually. Right? You can put your bowling balls, food products. Oh, yeah. Car tires, whatever you want in there. Full on People. cars. Hum wow, humans. You're looking to dispose your dead bodies there. That stuff. hydraulic press channel, you know, eventually they ran out of stuff. <laughs> That's actually accurate. That is what happens. You could be your own YouTuber at this apartment building. They had to switch to running their car over Orbeez. Right, they did end, they did end up doing that. All the hydraulic press channels mm -hmm. became or like press like press car your, press and it's yeah. like pressing things with cars is not nearly yeah. as exciting as hydraulics. Oh no. Shoot. Okay. Sorry, nice Steph. I'm sorry. Put... I'm sorry I let you down. Okay. It's nice that they go out after a little while. These do not go out. Okay, so we're going to have to definitely don't go out. We're going to have to do right, a flip cool. and jump. Whoa, Hop, skip. nice. Hop, right skip the... and a flip and jump. Flippity flip, flipping and flopping. Just flipping and flopping and collecting oil barrels sprinkled around this old man's house That's because. That's definitely an environmental hazard. Ooh. Oh man, this is like super Meat Boy style. Okay. Right? This time, we're gonna have to fall all the way down the middle. Yeah, totally. Oh my god. Okay. Wow. Okay. Wow. Take the leap! Mm, that was not, that was that not was ideal. The, that was the leap! <laughs> Take the leap! Oh! oh! That was awesome! That was really satisfying. That was awesome. Again, strangest arrangement. <gasps> oh, keys! Oh, keys. Hey, oh, keys. Okay, we need to pick a key and then we need to get out of here. Let's shove all the keys in my I shoe. Oh! Which key I should take, so I took all of them. Yes! Yes! Take all them oh, keys! Oh, this is so satisfying! Oh, this is great. Shove them all in your shoe, buddy. Right? Shoe them right up. up in the laces. Oh, man. Oh, get up in there. Oh, yeah. So much. Oh, oh, oh so much. Can I get this guy? Or am I going to have to jump in? Right. Boom toasted. <laughs> Boom electrified stuff. Right. Okay, here. I'm going to do this. Oh, let me actually get the ones down here. See, this is very cycle-based. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You can pick it up on a later cycle if you want. But, okay. Fair. You know, but you're going to be sacrificing about five frames. <laughs> you know? <gasps> Like we gotta, we gotta save the frames. Gotta save the frames. Save the frames, Steph. Save the frames. Matthew is secret. Like some people secretly want to be like a pop star or a professional basketball player. Matthew. I don't know why you would want to be though. To be a speed runner. I finally yeah. All of the keys. You no, you know I did. So do I just okay. Leave now? We have to go. I know. So that's why we're ending it right. 
Yes! That was so exciting. That was so exciting. Oh! Whoa! As soon as I heard the gunshots. Oh no, gunshots! Oh no! To oh, no. I, I'm working on it. Oh man. Oh, buddy. Oh, wait, I got, got flip. Got flip flop. Flippity gibbet. Okay. Oh boy. See, this is this is my audition for the speedrunner here. Okay. I don't even have any of the spare heads. No. Oh man. Ooh. Speedrunners don't need them. They do. They need those those sweet sweet D boosts. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh. Got flattened. That hydraulic press. Oh. That was really satisfying, actually. I'm kind of glad that, that I had that. That hydraulic death. press was really effective. We've tested it, you guys. It works. Happy to report back that the hydraulic presses Ooh. outside the apartment complex are in full working order. Okay, here we go. Last one. Go, go, go! Okay, Ooh, that was tight. That was a tight cycle. Tight cycle. Okay, here we go. Yes! Okay. I like all the different ways he can die, though. Like, those are cute and fun. Right? Whoops, that oh, was less cute. Oh, that was less cute. That, that, was less, that less cute way of dying is not as cute. Whoops. Oh, okay. Matthew, honestly, I just you wanted this to, on purpose. I wanted to make sure that it wasn't a glitch. I'm, I Matthew, consider me a beta test. What are you tester. doing? It's a tricky section, okay? Stop dying. It's <laughs> a challenging platformer, Steph. Do you see how I'm affected? Don't you... Don't you see how I'm affecting gravity to do my will? Okay, I'm gonna slow down a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna slow down here. What are you doing? <laughs> you know, sometimes when you're on a PB pace, you choke under the pressure. So. And somehow you're still on a PB pace. And yet I'm still on that PB pace. Because I recovered. I recovered quickly. Oh still on that PB. Oh, PB no. is the personal best for anyone who's not as big of a dork as we are. <laughs> for anyone who has a life. You say that. <laughs> Say Speed that, but is so cool. Ninja made a fortune off of being a pro gamer, That's so true. let's let's be honest. Yeah, but he wasn't even a speedrunner. He was just a. He was an okay player of Fortnite. He was a he was fine a, a player good, indeed. A good player of good, the Fortnite. A good, a good player. Oof. Okay. I don't think I can do we this. We have to leave. I know. I know. We gotta leave. We have to go. I know. You're so right. Yes. Yeah, we're there. Look, we're there. They're we're gonna the start the, the movie without. They, they're not. They are. They recognize how. Important nope, we everything. have nothing to do with the movie. WB does not care. That's They're very nice to invite us, but they will they were, not they were, they were very nice to invite us. That was so thoughtful of them. Yes, here we go. Look. This is the end of the... Oh, okay. Ah! Cycle base. I guess that's... Okay, okay, okay. Look. Got it. <gasps> and this should be... Okay. okay. I don't know why we're in a suddenly different part of the level. I thought... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ah! Alright. Okay, got my little robot head. Okay, here we go. That's, yeah. okay, that's, uh, those are things that can damage you. Oh, look at this. Steph, oh. how can you deny me this level of junk collection? Oh. What would you rather? Go see a Hollywood premiere or collect junk in this game? Oh, shoot. It's close, but I think we should probably go. What satisfies me most, Matthew, is fulfilling on our commitment. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's really funny. You're adorable. Let's go. Okay, let me get this through this No, one. no. There's always going to be more junk. You have a million junk to collect. I, I have We're so many not junk. Close. I have all the junks that look. Spoiler all alert. junk is cleared. Oh, look. There it was. Point at the gun. It's older. Mr. Silton's face. But the man looked terrified when he saw me. I wouldn't. I don't blame still him. picture his hand shaking as he reloaded his ancient oh, this poor old man. This wasn't the plan, shouted Mr. Silton. It's him or me. I choose old man. Let him have it. With what? Yeah, what What are we doing? All right, well. Oh, no, I don't want to kill him. I don't want to. No, wanna... that seems dumb. Oh, poop. Okay. See, this is I just want to talk! This is also very sad, I was going to do when I caught the old man. Okay, this is just like a way. As long as I'm timing my jumps and timing. Look, we're going to beat this chapter. It's great. But I knew I had to stop him. I, really? I feel like... Man, this old man. Everyone's like, oh no, oh no. This old and then Pastel Kitten says, hashtag save the frames. Okay. Save them, right? There you go. Save, gotta save those frames. See, see there, I should have waited a, a brief second for, to let the cycle pass. And Casey Neal, who says, friends, okay, it's okay, you'll make it in play. time for the commercials. At a premiere, they don't play the, the preview. That's true. They just start the movie. It's very disconcerting. You're like, I can't watch a movie without seeing previews. 
I know, right? What am I gonna what What am I gonna go see next time? Right? I have no idea where my life goes from here. You have to play the previews. Oh man, he's getting fast. I are we supposed to chase him even? Oh, oh, got him. Oh no! Oh no! Don't do it! Don't no, do no, it! No! No, 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 no! Collect the garbage and shove it in your Just shoe! Collect it! Just collect it! Shove it in it. your shoe! Violence is not the answer! Oh no! I killed no! it! What? Oh, Matthew! What? What did I do? Oh no! Matthew, you no! Know. What did I do? What? I can't believe you. What? What? I, I, and now we're in some 3D animation? What? All right. I kill, I disintegrated Matthew, him. The ruthless killer and I have to go now. God, you I don't disintegrated even him. Yeah, you did. Remember when I was like, should we even be chasing him, Matthew? Remember that? Man, all right. Well, he disintegrated. On that violent note. That's crazy. We have to go. Thanks for joining us crazy. on GT Live. No, we're still here. Matthew we has to feel sufficiently badly. We gotta watch about the cutscene. We gotta at least watch the cutscene. God. We're, and then it's probably the end of the chapter and it's a perfect breaking point. I can't believe you killed I didn't. I mean, I did, actually. Yeah, I'm sorry. I, I didn't. I think we should have not touched him. I don't think we had a choice. I don't think. Do we have a choice? I don't think we, I, we're doing genocide run. We shoved him in our shoe. Get in my shoe! Junk! You've been junked! Oh man. Junked in my shoe! No feet on the live stream, but I'm denying that because get in my shoe! I can't believe this. Wow. You know what I can't believe? We drove all the way back to a place that could I have handled across things the river. differently. Could you have handled things could differently? I Mr. Silton without hurting mm -hmm. that man. I Mr. Preston could see I was upset and I said music was a good alternative to facing up to problems. Oh boy. Come with me. He these insisted. people do not I'm sound like a good influence. I'm going to teach you how to play drums. Oh, he's going to teach me how to play drums. I don't think these people are our friends. That's that's a, that's very said, just nice. Play the it allows me to forget the fact that I just disintegrated we'll a man. We'll see how good your timing is. No, we don't have time for the drum mini game. We drum gotta get going. No, no, Matthew, no. Come on, and stop. We have to leave. Would you like to try that again? No. 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 Oh, here we go. No. Down, here. Even Give Chris me, is turning here. the game off. Thank you, Chris. Chris no. is okay, like, right. it reflects I'm right for the on rock my band job. There's a rock band mini game. Don't show There's up. There's a rock band mini game. No, Matthew, honestly. Yeah, look at that. We, we have to quit at some point during gameplay because it won't let me quit during narration. Okay. I'm just throwing that out there. Not you. Look at how good I am. Good. No, I'm good. Let's play it. We're going to play a song together. I'm going to go to the it. movie. This is it. I'll this have no it. one to tell me when I can uncover my eyes, but so be it. We're playing a song. Apparently, this is a mini game after I killed a man. I love you very much. I'll see you tomorrow. Matthew will be spending the night here, apparently. Thanks for watching KG Live! Woo! Okay, I got it now. Okay, I'm going. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. We'll be back tomorrow, 4 o'clock p.m. Pacific time, right? Tomorrow, 4 o'clock p.m. Pacific Yeah, great, good. TG Live. Bye. You gotta go see a crazy clown movie. Bye.